good afternoon. That's what I want to say. I'm not posted this week. It is Thursday. It's Thursday. Um, so, I just not been since Sunday of last week. Um, the everything I did Sundays hit this week. Excuse me. And my lower lumbar and sacrum is out of line. And it's just been miserable. But um, I, I, this is my first day really up and moving about. Getting my laundry done. <laughs> Somewhat getting my house in order. Um, Monday was painful. I felt like I'd been ran over by a couple dump trucks. And then Tuesday was my... Um, my spine and it's just gotten worse um, from all the hill climbing the, the jarring and all that um, what have I done besides try and recoup from Sunday um, made my appointment to the nature the naturopathic um, where she does different massages um, lymphatic massage normal massage deep tissue massage acupuncture the cups the stones um all that aromatherapy massages and all that good stuff and i made my appointment for i think it's tuesday or wednesday of next week to do the lymphatic massage and see how that goes and i really want to do the acu acupuncture because i really have enjoyed doing that once before um but i have the foot acupuncture massager that's got acupuncture needles in it and acupuncture it'll do it but I'm going to do the lymphatic Tuesday or Wednesday of next week for a 30 minute session and um I may sit in their sauna while I'm at it <laughs> I may I may not it just it just depends um other than that I'm fine it's just I'm sore and I'm all that hiking and climbing and jarring really, <laughs> I guess, woke them up out of sleep or whatever. And just had my, from the back of, from here, back all the way down. It's just been so tight and knotty. Um, so this is the first day I've really done anything. Got up and went, oh, I need to get some laundry done. I've not done it since last Saturday or Friday. Um our car <laughs> it's been down all week um what was it when we had when we had a tire put on it a couple weeks ago and they put and they did something to one of the the main brake line in the back rear um he had broke and didn't let us know he broke broke it one of the tire knobs where your tire fits on and where the brake where they bled the brakes um he twisted the the line so every time you were hitting the brakes the fluid was coming out we had brakes but constantly having to put brake fluid in it so found out that she's been parked since yesterday no she got to she finally got fixed yesterday the brake line and everything we just it's just that's why we rode the motorcycle this past weekend the car was down because the mechanic broke or twisted the brake line when he bled the brakes. There you go. I'm, I'm trying to think here. I'm tired. Um, it, it's overcast and a little breezy. It's like 80 degrees. Not really supposed to get above 82 <laughs> at all. So it feels okay today. It's just I'm tired. I'm worn out. Um. Tomorrow I've got to take my goldenrod tincture, my goldenrod tinctures that I made in jars, and I've got to keep them in there for two to four weeks. And tomorrow makes four weeks, so I've got to press that all out and put it into my tincture jars tomorrow. I could do it today if I want to. It just depends on how I feel. But I mean, I'm okay it's mentally, somewhat. It's just my my back, whole back is knots 
in rocks and just just miserable from that. That's why I'm not really posted this week because, I mean, I've really been down from Sunday. And then, I mean, Monday I didn't feel good at all. And I got up long enough to help my husband pick up the branches out of the yard so he can mow. So that bending over just intensified the spinal issues I've got and all the muscle back straps around it. So I'm just sitting here. Um, I've been relaxing this week because I'm too sore and too stiff to really do much of anything else. And I, at least I'm accomplishing laundry that's going right now. Get some laundry done. Um, my husband is off this week because he starts a new somewhere, a new um, same job, just a different location. So they gave him this whole week off. Before um, they start the new location, I'm hoping it's local. It's either here or it's in Nashville, which is, um, let's see, where I used to live. It was an hour and a half, and now I'm an hour away from where I used to live. So about almost three hours, depending on what part of Nashville they'll be transferring to. So he's off this week, but <laughs> he's off riding his motorcycle today. I told him there's no way I can get on it. My there's no amount of anything I can take <laughs> or smoke or tincture or anything that can ease it. So, I mean, mostly ice and heat packing it. Um, I've really stayed away from the medical stuff this week, except for yet um, for Monday. Boy, this week's just passed so quickly. So, I've just really just relaxed and rested, tried to get my back back into some form of huh and I mean I, I've already scheduled the lymphatic massage but I don't know if I want to do that one or switch it up to a um, normal light tissue massage to try and alleviate this tension and pinching feeling and knots because I'm right where my hips down feels like it's bone shards stabbing and pinching nerves it's just it's it's miserable so <clears throat> but I mean I don't know my husband's offered to massage me it's like I don't know I don't know yet but other than that that's why I've not posted this week I've been mostly ice and heat packing it due to this past Sunday's hike I'm not gonna stop doing that but I just I did too much at one time I put you know, what, what what is it that Teresa says to you gotta um something joy for pain you gotta have joy or you gotta you gotta have pain to have joy or something like that and I enjoyed it I did oh my goodness I did but and I didn't feel that bad Monday I felt bad and stiff all over but then Monday night Tuesday morning it was stiff as a board and then yesterday I woke up and it was okay my my muscles my leg muscles are relaxed but my back is now urgh. so it's just it's like it's taking a week to finally go from your leg your both your legs are can't you're walking stovepiped Monday the day after and then that night not start forming and then the next day it's stiff as a board back and then your legs are okay and then your arms feel like you've done Billy Banks workout punching bag non-stop and it's just all up in here and but I've done diddly squat today is my first day really get making it out of bed making it out of the couch because I don't like really sitting on the couch or sitting and laying in my bed unless it's a dire need, and this week was a dire need of don't move me, unless I have no choice. I mean, so it was. It's a, been a blessing. He's been home this week, but I let him go riding today because he's been with me. He knew it was gonna. I was gonna pay for it, but yet um, I'm blessed. I got to do it. I really am. So that's. It's just. And I've not had the strength to really just sit down, get up, sit down in front of a computer and 
make any post at all. I just have it. And my husband, he just brought my desk. Excuse me. I have a desk, a computer desk, good size one. And he finally brought it in yesterday. So I've got to get that all dealt with. It's just in there. So I've got to get that organized, get everything put together. But I mean, I've, I, it's been a beautiful week. It's just I've not felt beautiful or <laughs> healthy wise, less painful wise. But it's slowly improving. It's slowly improving, and all I can do is just heat an ice packet. But that's my vlog from Monday to today, guys. I'm tired, and the longer I sit here in this chair, the more painful my spine is getting where it's right up. It's from the lower part, and it's raising up all the way to my back where my chest plate is straight back, and it's just it's getting more and more painful as I sit here, and it's starting to lock me up, so... I'm going to let you guys go. Um, God bless you. And remember, I'm praying for you all. Bye, guys.